Hi, I'm Pastor Gary Rideout, uh, one of the co-senior pastors of St. Andrews United Methodist Church in Brandon, along with my wife, Jane. And we just concluded a, a sermon series uh, this past Sunday entitled, Where Do You Stand With Your Money? It, it gives you the premise of what would money say to you? What would money have to say to you? From, from the, We got the material from the Andy Stanley book, If Money Talked. And it's an interesting premise. If, if money would talk to you, if you, if you have a, a relationship with your money, which you all do, what would your money say about you? What would it want to say to you? So, uh, for example, we looked at, I can add meaning to your life, but I'm not the meaning of life. And the moment you think you own me, I actually own you. And when we looked at this past Sunday, what you choose to do with me speaks volumes about who and whose you are. So it's the premise is when you're gone, uh, when you're not here anymore, what would money say about you and how you relationship with money. So uh, this book here brings us some interesting premises and I want to ask, ask some of these questions or some of these statements to see how you would react to it. And I'm talking about me, how money would, what money would say about me. He recognized that money belongs to God and he was merely managing it for a while. Now, these are the things I think I want money to say about me. Here's another one. He got his financial situation in good shape so he could say yes when he felt called to do things. He gave money for decades to an organization he was grateful for, even though he did, they didn't ask. He responsibly managed money and tracked every expense, even when he didn't need to. And he put money where his heart was and gave generously. And then the last one, he flipped the script of managing money from first living with some leftover for giving to give first save second and live on the rest. These are thoughts to ponder about yourself. What would you want money to say about you and how you related and managed your money during your lifetime? Thank you.